Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday, and normally I don't post any videos on the weekends, but I am so appreciative to all of you who commented some encouraging words which inspired me to make another show, a special Saturday Astro Affirmation show for today. Um, thank you to my viewers from the Philippines, India, Cambodia, the United States, and Canada. Thank you for your comments. They inspire me. Yes, today I thought that I would give you a view of my backyard. This is the Big Blue House's backyard. And as you can see, my pecan tree still looks petrified. Yes, everything else is green. All the foliages of the other trees are in. And I am out here with my pug, Urgent. Hi, Urgent. Are you basking in the glory of the sun? Yes, grounding yourself on the earth because today the energy is coming from our root chakra, our foundation, the base of our spine, the muladhara in Sanskrit, which means base or foundation. I'm here in my favorite spot in the backyard. This is a naturally growing um, tree or bush of a, a trumpet flower. They are these beautiful orange flowers that the hummingbirds frequent, the bees too, but they look like this. You see those? orange flowers there yes they love those so I call this area in the backyard my hummingbird cove because it looks like a cave don't you think see there's the fountain that I dedicated to my late brother Alexis after he passed away, my brother Ray said that he was visited by hawks. And um, my husband, the man, found this hawk at a yard sale across the street like about a few weeks ago. And it fit right into the tube that is on this broken fountain that I inherited from my next door neighbor Kay when she passed away. So that's where I sit, and today I have that um, that cup, that disposable cup that my daughter TLC, aka Trinity Lauren Conley, bought from Target. And it's really cute. When I go back over there, I'll show you closer so you can have a better look. But I wanted to show you the way this tree or bush, whatever you want to call it, it's a trumpet flower bush naturally curves its branches to make like a cave for this this little grotto i guess and i sometimes i call it lourdes's grotto after my mom and she passed away too in 2002. so anyway this cup is kind of red right so i figured oh yeah i'll have my coffee in this cup and it's cute because it says love on it. And I love Snoopy. Snoopy is holding balloons that say love. And you know me and love. <laughs> I'm a love queen who is a big hugger. So anyway, yeah, today's energy is a grounding type of energy 
okay? So I will probably go under that um, copper pyramid there by the pecan tree and um, do some grounding work because the ruling energy of today is the root chakra and the color that opens and activates and balances the root chakra is red. So wear red, eat red fruits, drink red drinks, surround yourself with the color red, okay? Now I'm talking about chakras <clears throat> and chakras, chakra is a Sanskrit word meaning spinning wheel. And if you watch my other videos, you know that I like to call it spinning spheres because we are three-dimensional in form. And so I believe our inside is also three-dimensional and a wheel is not, in my opinion, three-dimensional, it's more flat. And so I like to call it spheres. Like they're vortices of vitality that powers our physical bodies, right? So it's important to exercise the spirit as well as the body because that's what gives the body the energy to work, to live and thrive and survive in this three-dimensional plane of existence. Say hi, Urgent. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love you. I know how you love your ears, the behind the ear scratch. She loves that. Yeah, so the root chakra is um, stable. It's secure, right? Like when you get, if you get a chance today, do like what Urgent does. Just sit right on the bare earth. Feel Mama Gaia's energy just coming in through your root chakra because that is our connection to earth. The root chakra is like a plug to the source of our origin, which our body came from earth, right? If you look it up on the internet, you'll see that the body is composed of elements of the earth, right? So yeah, um, it will make you feel secure, safe, stable, just as the symbol for the root chakra is a square, you know, or a cube, right? If you uh, drop a cube on the ground, it's not gonna go anywhere. It's gonna just stay there. As opposed to if it was a ball or a sphere, it would roll around and move, right? But a square is stable and secure, right? Just like the house, it's made up of four walls, or a room, I should say, <clears throat> because like our house here, it's got a lot of different angles and the walls are more than four in some areas, but um, a room is usually four walls, right? When you build something, four walls makes it stable. Or a chair, for instance, four legs on the chair makes it secure as opposed to three legs, right? So anyway, yeah, that's the root chakra, the muladhara. Muladhara means base, foundation. And the color is red. Okay, red for blood, you know, our life force. It says in the Bible that life is in the blood, right? And the blood is red no matter where it is inside or outside the body, it's red. I looked it up. 
I thought at one time that inside the body it's blue because you know my um my skin there it's really thin so you can see my veins through my skin and I thought oh the blood inside the veins must be blue but it isn't I looked it up and it says it's scarlet red and then when it comes out of the body it's bright red so it's still red no matter how you look at it but yeah I'm sitting here next to my pool this is my jacuzzi here and it fits like 12 people we made sure that we had um, enough capacity to fit many people in there because everybody wants to go on the jacuzzi, right? So anyway, yeah, I'm just so glad and happy to see that um, you guys are appreciating my show, my Astro Affirmation Show, which I do every day except for Saturday and Sunday. But today I thought, you know what? I'm gonna do a Saturday special and just to let you guys know how much I appreciate you and love you. So here I am signing off at the Big Blue House. I am the bear of the Big Blue House. So the moon, the bear and the Big Blue House will be waiting for you to come on Monday and play with me okay bye for now namaste